warlock, eh? Well, if you've got a mind to be doing that sort of thing around here, then you best keep your demons on a leash, girly. I don't like demons, but I love putting my axe to them. You get me? Now you just leave me be and go get lost in the forlorn cavern. That's where you'll find that warlock Thistleheart. Hello everybody, welcome back to Nude Nancy, as we continue our journey in Dark Shore, hoping to finish this today and make our way over to Red Ridge Mountains. Let's do it. Yesterday we left our character outside this cave, so we could come in and kill some Nagas. Looks like there's already someone here so we'll have to honestly it'll probably be nice because we could probably get through this pretty fast if they're uh, if they're also here just gonna tidy up our little quest list here okay so we need the death cat doesn't look like we need to kill anybody See if we can pick this up before she casts a spell at us. Nice. Let's see if we can help this gentleman out while we're navigating ourselves through this. Seems like there's really not too much I need to do. Just get these saber stalks and I guess try and get the death cap, which is most likely at the end of the cave, so. We'll have to do a little bit of killing. Build a heal that well. She practically healed herself for the whole amount. Alright, seems like maybe I have to go up, not down. So we're gonna try and make our way up. This guy's being very rude. Okay. These guys are our level, so that's nice. Probably gonna heal him, which isn't very good. That's that's a ridiculous amount of healing. <laughs> and that should not be allowed. Hey, 
two is pretty crazy that they can heal that much. We still didn't take care of our inventory issue, which obviously is an issue. So why don't we, really quickly, why don't we try and uh, make some bolts? And that way we're able to, okay, can't make any bolts. <laughs> so, hmm. What can we get rid of? I guess we can get rid of this. And then that will allow us to create our bolts. And that will turn a lot of cloth. So about four stacks of cloth. It seems like into four stacks of leather. So I guess that really doesn't help us too much. But I guess we'll get rid of this first linen stack and we'll just, we'll keep going. I feel like I turned off chat as well. Maybe. It's possible. Let's see. I did. Let's, let's enable chat. Just in case. how much damage they can do. Probably it's been better if we all just joined the group. Try and get on this side so if he hits us backwards we don't get knocked down. Looks like there's a few death caps up here, so I don't have to worry about taking people's stuff. <laughs> okay. We are so close. 11 steps. So we're... We're close. <laughs> Let's inspect him. Let's see what he's working with here. Must be nice to uh, be able to use all your runes. Oh. Ideally, as long as we have the time, we will most likely try and start our other warlock quest. I think that should get us the next demon, to my knowledge. Succubus, possibly. We'll see how that works for us. I've never really used the warlock that I play in retail. I don't play actively. Uh, he is more so used to just farm old school content, so I don't really care what demon he's using. Generally, I just go Voidwalker as a tank, but I've never really researched warlocks to see, you know, the proper, proper way to, to do stuff. I take our chicken out. We haven't had our chicken out in a while. What is this? Cliff Spring something something. Looks like we need to do something here. Probably at the bottom, but let's let's try at the top first, just in case. I'm assuming we have some kind of a vial. Requires yeah, okay. So we need the waterfall, which is down here. Hopefully we don't die. Okay. I'm assuming it was gonna have me do this. Probably next, but we're here, so. And the reason that it probably didn't have me jump in the water is because now I'm lower to the ground. So that's fun. It probably would have had me accept the quest and then jump in the water. That would have been the smarter option. Okay, of course now 
that put ourselves in a position that we can't get up. All right. It's like it never happened. Hey, look at that. Then it says jump down. <laughs> That's smart. Fine crab chunks. Any crabs around here? You got you got my fine crab chunks. We'll try and try and kill as we go here. Our chicken's not even helping. Should help fight. Wow, resisting. That's illegal. Hmm. Well, bear meat sells for a lot. I I really don't. I really don't know. I need to get rid of some inventory here. Sharp claw it is. That gets me the crawler meat. Open this. Oh, uh, that's clam meat. Ugh. Clam meat and crawler meat. Two different things. Right, let's get rid of the crawler claw. Not sure if that was a good idea or not. Now we have two spots. We need fine crab chunks. So we are going to immediately attempt to gather that while we're running this way. We're so close to done that I don't see us, I don't see why we wouldn't finish this today. Look at all these things, my goodness. I know, I don't want that. I would like the fine crab chunks, please. Thank you very much. All right, let's send you after him. Let's see if we can uh, get like a cool, like a cool background shot of us killing him while we're you know, dealing with this. So if we go like here, maybe. Uh, could you not kill him just yet? I'm trying to... <laughs> that should suffice at least. I have been poisoned. Oh no. <laughs> well, obviously we need to get these out of our inventory. I'm not sure why I haven't put them in the bank. That would obviously be the smarter decision. And why I haven't done it, I don't know. All right, let's see wants us to go over here, so I guess we'll try and kill crabs along the way. Let's see if we can find crabs along the way. And you're dead. There we go. Hmm. Four more claws. Four more claws. Okay. There's no crabs in the water. That stinks. There we go. There's a bunch of crabs. Can we take on two at once? Let's find out. Mm, yeah, I think.
think we're good. That should end in a second and heal us. Crab chunks. Uh, 13 silver is probably worth it over... Uh, uh, we need the tight sea to all mains. We need those. Clam meat, it looks like, is the... Is the loser. Yes, thank you. Still need... Some more. I think that might be the final quest, so we can almost we can almost actually collapse the menu a little bit. Alright, let's let him get the let's let him. Yeah, I figured. Two more meat. Eight more steps. Nice. One more meat. Right, let's be a little more cautious here. We'll fear him. He'll come back. They always come back. They kind of have to. It's, it's a mechanic of the game. This game would be a lot more interesting if enemies just ran from you. <laughs> just chasing them all around. I didn't put my heal on him, so this could prove to be bad, but I think it'll be fine. There we go. Still don't have that last thing, but we still got a good minute walk or so to... Alright, let's do that. Okay, let's see. I think he's got it. He's got that final crab chunk. This is a fat crab. Definitely, he definitely has those chunks. He does, look at that. Alright, and luckily these things aren't aggressive, so we can just run right past them. So we have a quest. We have a bunch of quests to turn in at Darkshore, so that's probably the end game here is run back to Darkshore and turn these all all these quests in. Hopefully that'll be it. Uh we gotta uh, Let's do this. Fear him. He's gonna probably go the wrong way. Can I do this? Nice. Oh no. Why do we do this to ourselves? We're so close to. Oh no. Okay, let's do that. We gotta get better at probably stealing more souls. We don't have any room for him right now, but you know. All right, while he's running away, do we have anything that we can get rid of? I guess crawler meat? Let's just get rid of the crawler meat. Don't get your friend. Can you not? <sighs> yeah, too far away. Right here. Let's back up. <laughs> and portal out of here. Maybe we can get a nice shot of us. Let's see if we can do it in time. I guess not. I guess you can't really take a photo of yourself doing that. Alright, this hopefully wraps up this guide. There's six steps left, so I'm assuming it's just turn in, turn in, turn in, turn in. Hi there, I'm Gubba Blump. Wow! 
These fine crab chunks are what I need. Thanks, adventurer. I found this while I was fishing a while ago, and I have no use for it. Okay, Maybe you can do fish. something with it. It sure don't make any good crab dishes. I told you all about crabs, right? May Alun walk with you, adventurer. The Temple of the Moon has come to help the troubled citizens of Oberdeen. I have heard of the kinds of carriages found on the back of the turtle you found. Those, I do believe, are Naga carriages, used both in battle and in transportation of their supplies onto land. The markings on the box you found are of the Naga. This would explain their invasive presence in far northern Darkshire. I will send this box to Darnassus along with the rest of your discoveries. This is for you. Thank you again for your assistance. It is interesting that the Murlocs were not present at this site. We will keep this in mind as we study this creature's remains. Thank you for your effort, adventurer. The Temple of the Moon would like for me to give you this as compensation for your time. Many thanks, adventurer. These mushrooms are fine specimens. And when you were at Cliffspring Falls, did you find anything to confirm the warnings of the ancients? The ancients are wise, but I had hoped that, this time, they were wrong. It's no surprise how tainted this water is, but just look at how putrid it is becoming. It would seem that action is needed sooner than later, eh, adventurer? To our east is Fellwood. It is the real source of this corruption, one that I have seen in times past. I predict this sample will confirm this. We might be able to enact a cure for it here, but in order to even try, we will need assistance. When that time comes, adventurer, I hope you will be able to give the aid we need. You guys, we have finished this section of Darkshore. We got called a whore. So that's also good. You know, it's a pretty uh, pretty good day. We are going to make our way back to, I believe it's Stormwind. It's going to want me to take it to and try and finish her Ironforge. It's going to try and get us to get our class quest done. So we'll see how that goes. As we approach the boat, we obviously have to dance because we always dance and people get all mad at us. I hope you guys are having a good day. This week has definitely gone not too bad work-wise and personal-wise and game-wise, so it's always, uh, always nice. I think I scared him away. Wonder why everyone's a corporal. I don't know if that's just PvP based or or what. Is that not our boat? Oh good. I thought that was not our boat, and that oh, that would have been a little frustrating. So we're gonna head to Menetho. Menetho, we're gonna probably fly to Don Maru. We just enjoy. This is one of my favorite things to do, is just dance on this box on the boats, and then ideally hide my chat, so when people get upset, they, uh, I don't know that they're upset until we look at our screen again.
I should probably look and see uh, if we're back. <laughs> and nobody has commented. Are we still at the dock? Oh, good, we left. I was about to just jump off the boat. <laughs> that would have, uh, that would have annoyed me. Captain Nancy. Nude Nancy Captain. Ooh. I was about to jump. Yeah, we're not gonna head back to Dark Shore, so. Hold your horses. So we're heading back to Menethil. We are going to go to Dunmorell. We are going to deposit a lot of stuff into our bank and and stop taking it out of our bank because that makes it harder. We probably haven't lost a bunch of money, but we've lost money. I definitely could have jumped off there. We're going to make a jump for it. Oh my goodness. Nope. Oh my goodness. Did you see that luck? Wow. Clip it. So we have to do Gakin's Summons, and that was a level 20. So let's see, we have to accept the quest. And it looks like it's going to kind of take us around, so we'll, we'll see. We may, we may leave that for tomorrow's episode. Try and go from there, so let's see. We want to fly... Where would you like to fly to? Well, if you let me talk. I can tell you. Okay. Oh, I don't like that this person's right behind me. Right up my rear. Oh no. There he is. <laughs> I very much like this. It's not very often that you both take a griffin at the exact same time. See if we get any good shots. Let's blush at him. Oh, I can't blush. We can kiss. That was a magical journey. Gakin summons will also most likely take us to a warlock trainer. Another thing we're going to have to look into is our guild. And try and figure out kind of where we stand with them. Are we going to be able to raid with them? Skyline Getter. Why is Ironforge always so loud? Nomergon Exiles. Okay. Well, that guy obviously wanted to be Dragonfire. So now he is Dagonfire. You know another big thing? I'm surprised that I'm still allowed to have the name Nude Nancy. So, I mean, I guess another challenge would be, can I make it to level 40 before uh, I get kicked out? Alright, why is there... Why are there mage trainers and priest trainers, but no warlock trainers? I don't like that very much. 
Do I just not see the warlock trainer? What do you need directions to? Class trainer. Which class trainer might you be looking a for? Warlocks. A warlock, hey? Well, no. if you've got a mind to be doing that sort of thing around here, then you best keep your demons on a leash, girly. I don't like demons, but I love putting my axe to them. You get me? Now you just leave me be and go get lost in the forlorn cavern. That's where you'll find that warlock Thistleheart. I mean, that's not very nice. Can I help you? The arcane oh, only corrupts those who are weak. Keep up on your training or you may find a similar fate. Not sure if that's worth it. Ritual of summoning... I just, I don't think I need right now. Um, definitely getting Shadow Bolt. I don't know if we need AoE right now. Searing Pain could be good. It's a one and a half second cast. I mean, it's, you know, not, not much more than these other ones. 36 to 45 damage. Hmm. I don't really know if any of those are, are worth it. Health funnel's not terrible, but my Voidwalker dies, so it doesn't help me. We're gonna get on any breath. It's quite embarrassing when I die. The arcane only corrupts those who are weak. Keep up on your training, or you may find a similar fate. I do apologize for the volume. Definitely let me know if it's too loud. I I need to adjust it, I think. How is there not... Interest in the fight. How is there not a demon trainer? There's got to be a demon trainer, right? I mean... The arcane only oh, corrupts those who are weak. Keep up on your training or you may find a similar fate. You're too loud. Why are there three warlock trainers, but no demon trainer? I don't want to search for him. It's around somewhere. We're gonna have to get some demon training. I feel like there's definitely some demon stuff. All right, let's do that. And demonology, let's do unending breath over there. What else do we have, anything else? I guess that was it. All right. Now we make our lovely way. Let's see. Is this a warlock? That is a warlock. I called it. Downstairs in the building. Oh, we'll go. We'll go over here. The wild hammer dwarves might have fast steeds. But can those airy peak griffins stand the heat of the Great Forge? I think not. <laughs> All right. While we are flying, why don't we look at some of these? Uh... Let's see if we can look at Questy. What? You could show trivial quests? Oh, my goodness. I didn't know any of these things. I want to show repair people. Bankers would be good. I don't know if class trainers is worth it, because I mean, we'll for the most part know where we're going, ideally. I guess we will show tailoring and enchanting, and cooking and first aid and fishing. And we would like to show. I don't need any of those. What else can we do with this? If we could, I would like to not show them. All right, we don't want that to happen, so that that takes care of that. Um, I 
Hmm. Show only quests granting experience. I, I don't really care about that too much. I mean, I guess we can make this... What are we? We're level 21, so anything level 15 to, I guess, just like 20. I don't know what that even does. Tracker. Oh, oh goodness. What did that do? Okay, I think, I think we figured it out. We got rid of that. So I don't have to worry about it now. Now what I would love to do is quiet this thing up. Oh, look at this. They got filters now. So I might be able to... Oh my goodness, there's a lot to go through here. Ideally, we just want to turn the sound off if we can. Just so that we don't have to worry about it yelling at us. Yeah, I will have to go over this. So those are our class defaults. We don't even, we're not even in these phases, but I guess eventually we'll have those phases. We don't want to show spell ranks. We'll have to go through this and figure it out. Okay. So this does have us going to our Warlock Trainer, so what we are going to do is we are going to make a pit stop at the bank. We are going to get all of our linen cloth turned into bolts. And maybe see if we can get a few of these supplies. So between today and tomorrow, we'll get a nice little plan in place. And that way tomorrow we'll have a lot to do. And we'll try and finish off strong for the week. And just try and finish as much as we can get finished. Oh, I was like, I can't wait until I can do that, but I, I can't. That's pretty sure that's priest. That is a warlock. Well, I guess I can't do that. No one's ever stolen anything out of here. Not in the whole history of the whole history. Yeah, he keeps saying that, but I mean, I feel like people have stolen. Okay. Be careful. Look at all this space for activities. 22 slots. We have a bunch of gold from Ned as well. I us say a bunch, but I mean six and a half golds. Pretty, pretty good. And we want to give Ned all the items that we don't want. So let's see what kind of stuff we have. This is Transmog. We don't want to give him the flasks. We can get rid of that. And I guess we'll call We'll call these random. We have some food. That's some food, and then this is random. Okay. Looks like we have a lot of soulbound things. So we need a vendor. And we might as well go over here. We do need, we're definitely going to be going to the auction house to go shopping. We need to update this stuff because we're not. We're not a low level anymore. Best deals in all of Stormwind, my friend. Won't find any better. Now, what can I help you with? So loud. I feel like this is pretty good. But I can't use it because I have... Wait, this is minus three spirit? Why would I minus three spirit? In what world do I want a minus out. spirit? No worlds. That's where... All right. I think it's been a pretty successful episode. We finished Lakeshore, Lakeshore, Lakeshore. I don't, I don't know how you say it honestly. 
And I think the only other thing that I wanted to look at was voiceover and see if we could maybe maybe just make it a little quieter sound channel mute vocal NPCs greetings while voiceover is playing yes I don't know because yeah that would really be my next ideal thing it's just kind of make them a little quieter. But, uh, yeah, oh well. Gakin's Summons. Devourer of Souls. I'm not sure what it's going to want us to do. But we are going to buy some demon runes if possible. Can I help you? Yes, adventurer? I'm glad someone was able to get a hold of you, adventurer. I was beginning to fear the worst. It would be a shame to lose you after the time we've invested in you. We can talk later, though. Your training is the only important thing now. A succubus is a devourer of souls, destroyer of hearts, and dominator of minds. Damn. It knows nothing but evil. This will be the creature you will learn to summon and control, but it cannot be brought into our world without a stimulus. With a symbol of love as bait, it will surely answer your call. Then you can defeat it and make it your tool. It will be hard to find something of this nature, though. You should speak with Tacker the Seer. You will find him in the Barrens of Kalimdor near Camp Tarajo. Okay. Grimoire of Firebolt. And we have to get that for our Void Walker, which we don't have out right now, so. Can I die? Oh, goodness, that scared me. <laughs> it's getting pretty steamy in here. <laughs> Alright, guys. Thank you so much for watching. It's always a pleasure. I hope you guys have enjoyed our adventure today. Dark Shore is done. We're going to get our succubus next episode. In between episodes, we will look at our tailoring, look at our enchanting, and look at all of our crates and see what we can do about those. Now that we have some gold, maybe we can get some of those crates out of our inventory. I'm, I'm hoping that's what happens. And just kind of go from there. So thank you again for watching. If you have any tips, tricks, comments, please let me know, and we'll go from there. Thanks for watching. Talk to you guys tomorrow. Peace. Blue Dancy, Blue Dancy, and White Stallion.